that's sort of an interesting one because as you as you were talking and kind of thinking about like the locations that you're you're mentioning there in the valley um I, i'm kind of thinking now in, in terms of memory and kind of some memory landscape in the valleys that we we have so many battles and relatively few battlefields that are actually preserved in the valley i mean the national park service only has a one at cedar creek and that's not even fully theirs it's this the partnership park that you have and then you have mm -hmm. that shrine to jackson um further down the valley i forget where exactly um and it, it seems like and not to mention that whole interstate that cuts through pretty much all of the battlefields and destroying right. some of the battlefield landscape. But mm -hmm. it seems like that there's a great opportunity here to, um, to do more with regard to the uh, commemoration memory of, of the reconstruction era, these schools um, mm -hmm. that are being put in place. Yeah, absolutely. So let me, let me I, can, I can make this, this public announcement. So Shenandoah University, last year we applied for a grant uh, with the legacies of american slavery project so this is a this is a project that's being managed by the council for independent colleges and funded by the andrew mellon foundation and then working in collaboration with david blight up at the gilder lehrman center for the study of abolition resistance and slavery i think i i don't know if i got those words in the right order but um so it's one of the title, what title. yeah it's a long title so what we what we applied to do and we were named an affiliate partner in this. So there's there's regional partners, there's affiliate partners, there's 17 institutions in total. Um, but we are are wanting to look at at issues of, of memory and commemoration and specifically emancipation commemoration. Mm. Um, so yeah, I, I think we have we're in the early stages of this this grant. It's a it's a three-year project, but we are gonna kind of develop further you know, some of these, some of these initial themes I explore in the book, but I, I want to really, you know, dig deeper and look, you know, at all of these communities and how they are, how they're pushing back against the lost cause, because clearly they are. Um, but now I just want to, to kind of investigate further the, the, the broader extent of that, and that grant's going to allow us to, to do that. Wow, that sounds fascinating, and going to keep you occupied for the next few years. Yeah, and yeah. Yeah. Um, 